Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. You guys, today I am going to be building a brand new family generational home. Now, I loved doing this build. I thought it was actually really fun to do. It took me a couple days. I have been just like so busy, um, but I, I actually really like it and I did post some photos or I'm going to be posting some photos on my Instagram account. So if you guys want to do check that out, it will be in the description down below. And also I am doing a new room build. Now, usually what I'm going to try and do every month is going to be a new type of shell and I'm going to be posting it on my Instagrams. There actually has already been a couple of people who are doing the room right now. It is literally just a room shell. I did a normal like actual house before as a shell and now this month it's just a room so it's gonna be so much easier to do. So basically what it is is that you just download it from my gallery which everything again will be in the description down below and then you just upload it to the gallery using the hashtag simspo room and then I will find it. I'll download it and then hopefully you guys I'm gonna be making like a top 10 of my favorite builds and I'm gonna be posting it on my Instagram so if you do want to go check that out and um, participate it will be up until November 15th so you guys have some time if you guys want to participate we do have a couple of people already that have been already making the room so I'm actually really freaking excited um, and if you guys also want to put in your Instagram handles down below as well um, that would um, or I guess in your descriptions that will also help me as well because then I can tag your uh, gallery name and I can also shout you out there on Instagram as well and I am just really excited so if you guys want to do that all of the details of the whole shell itself will be on my Instagram so make sure to check that out now this house I do want to talk a little bit about it just because I find that I'm gonna start rambling on about my stories and my previous um, video that I did. It was actually one of my bigger face reveals that I've done and it's gonna be my face all the way through the actual like video and it was me reacting to the for rent expansion pack that we're getting and I am so freaking excited for that pack you guys. You have no idea and I didn't realize that I had some of my background music going on over top of my of the trailer and I was so annoyed when I found that out after, so I was like, I'm sorry. And I also didn't notice that on my phone when I'm watching back the video, it's like a couple like seconds behind of me talking, but on the computer it's not. It's weird. I'm not too sure if it's just my phone or not. Um, but yeah, I apologize if you guys have watched that one and found something weird. I think like throughout the video it gets better. But I'm not too, too sure. But if you guys are new, hi, how are you? My name is Jamie. I'm also known as Simspiration here on YouTube. And I do a lot of speed builds. I do a lot of just like big builds. And now I'm trying to like make more houses, maybe do some more review builds, uh, sorry, review videos and all that fun jazz. So if you guys want to stick around to see all those in the future, make sure to press the little subscribe button and be a part of our little growing family. I'm actually super happy. We just passed over 7 k Hey, and on my Instagram, my Simstagram account, I guess, I just went over 700 on there. So I'm very excited. It's been growing pretty quickly on my Instagram. So if you guys want to check those out again, um, I will have everything in the description down below. Now, again, this house, we have a bunch of things going on because I feel like I'm going to start branding off in tangent and I need to stick, I need to be focused. <laughs> I need to be focused. Now, this house has a lot going on it has like an onsen like back uh like a bathhouse in the back there's like a gazebo there's somewhere where you can do like your um gardening i also really really like the way that the garage turned out on one side uh it's a little smaller and then the other side is a little bit bigger and i think towards the end of the build i'm not too sure if i had that recorded but i have that gonna be kind of like a game room almost so that one is really cute and I think there's like about three bathroom no three bedrooms and four baths um so this place is pretty big I'm actually really happy with the way it turned out I had a lot of fun it was a really weird for me to try and figure out like where I wanted everything to be um but as you guys keep watching you will see that like I I'm gonna try and cut out some of the spots where I had a lot of trouble but I <laughs> 
<laughs> I I had some I had a hard time even figuring out like where I wanted to lay it out. Um, so honestly, I thought I was like, okay, well, what if I just started like making a room, and then I could make walls around it to make it like. A, a separate room and then try and figure out the layout afterwards and it just wasn't working i i have such a hard time trying to figure out where i want things to be and even if you guys catch me on any of my lives i'm actually doing I, my most recent live i was doing a fixer upper and i think my next live that i'm gonna have i'm just gonna do the interior but the exterior if you guys watch i'm like sitting here the entire time with everyone i'm like i i don't know how to make this build right i don't know how to make it look nice like <laughs> It was so bad. It was so like, and everyone's like, no, you got this. And I'm like, I feel like I just want to like turn off the live. Even when I'm recording, like to make a video, I always like stop my, my, like my OBS, which is what like the software I use to record. I always like pause it because I feel like I'm just wasting like time. And if it's recording, then I feel like I can't process my thoughts well. And I don't know how to make things work. I, I don't know. I don't know like what happens to me, but it, it's just the thing. <laughs> but anyway, I wanted to let you guys know um, that little spot because I don't really know how to talk about builds. I promise uh, your girl will get better in the future. I, I promise. But I do want to guys, I want to tell you guys some stories because the previous video that I did, like I was saying before, is that I went to Thailand with my mom and this new for rent pack is, um, you know, based on for uh, Thailand. So I wanted to tell you guys um, some stories that happened or if I have time. I'll just tell you this one story for now, but it was a little weird. It was a little crazy and uh, Okay, so I'll start so I was going to Thailand with my mom and it was just her and myself and we went into like a, a group of people so we we had like a whole group of people people that we met there and they would just take us to different parts of Thailand um, and just show us everything together and we'd stay in the same hotels like it was just a really great like I think it's called like gate one or something so you just go in groups anyway so the people that we had were just insane a lot of them were super nice but there was this two couple there was this couple and the man and the woman were like super mean and and they were like very rich right okay so you know like we have people who are rich who are really nice and humble and then there's others that are just like no you suck because i have money like that that kind of thing <laughs> that kind of thing is what happened and i remember my mom and i getting to one of the hotels and everyone it was late at night everyone got there and we all like got our keys to go into the rooms and our room was like really beautiful i think it was like on a higher level so we could have a great view of where we were and it was so nice so after my mom and i got everything down um you know and like put our luggage away just kind of got ready for dinner we went back down and the couple um was with everyone waiting and we were all gonna go out for dinner together and the people um who were else in our group they're like oh what floor are you on and I think there was like 15 floors I think my mom and I were on like the 13th or 14th like it's kind of just random like my mom and I we don't we don't choose the room they kind of just like give it to us and so we like went down they're like oh what room are you on and I I was gonna say like my mom and I were I think we said like the 14th we're like oh we're on like the 14th floor and then the the rich couple they were the wife she was a little bit crazier than like the husband um but the wife was just like um, I'm sorry, what? And we were like, oh, yeah, like, we're the 14th, why, what are you guys? And then she goes, oh, we're on the 12th, like, what the heck, that's not, that can't do, like, we need to have the best room, what the heck, and she started, like, getting mad at her husband, because she was like, why don't we have it, you need to go talk to the people and make their, because, you know, we should be on the top floor, this and that, and I was just like, oh, my gosh, I'm like, 14 so I was like I don't even know like I'm just sitting back listening to all this I'm like is this seriously like what people <laughs> anyway I I don't know so that happened and that wasn't the only time that she would like complain we had to take a flight um to Bangkok to Ho Chi Minh City I think it is or I, I don't know I'm getting confused because we went to Vietnam after but I think it was from Bangkok to Ho Chi Minh City uh or Halong Bay I think it was to Halong Bay um in from Bangkok I'm not too sure but it was like a two-hour flight that we had to like take again when we were in Bangkok to somewhere else and while we were there it was just like a little small commercial flight because like we just needed to go like a couple hours away and so our group was on there 
and we all hop aboard everything is fine everything is dandy we walk onto the plane we all sit down right and then the the lady i don't even know i can't even remember her name i think her name was barb or something but like barb walked into um the back and she goes um why aren't we in first class and her husband was like i i don't know like we're just we, we're just only here for two hours it's not that big of a deal and she was like no i don't have any room this is this can't do she's like we should be up there where's our our tour guide and our tour guide was in first class because of the gate one thing like they they just allow them to be in first class and it wasn't even like a fancy plane it was just a normal plane and uh so she <laughs> She was like, no, 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 this can't do. <laughs> she she gets up and then she starts complaining to like the 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 uh, the plane staff and then she starts complaining to our tour guide and our tour guide guy was so nice. Our tour guide guy, <laughs> our tour guide, he was so nice. He was so sweet and you could tell like he was just like he he was ha he wasn't having it with them and it was just too much. Like obviously he's like I I definitely ain't getting paid enough for this, but. <laughs> He was just like, you know what? Here, take my plane. Take, not take my plane. Take my seat. Come take my seat. And he'll sit with like her husband. And her husband was like, oh my God, like I can't believe my wife. And then everyone else is like super like blown away by the way that this happened. Like it was so weird. And honestly, guys, we would class her as like a Karen nowadays. Like that's the word for her. She was a Karen. And it was just crazy, but she would hang out with my mom um, and myself and this other man and these like two other couples or something. And we would kind of be like a little group together that we go do things. So I guess like we could tolerate them for the majority until until like one night we all went for dinner. And I don't know where we were. I think it was in Halong Bay. I'm not too sure. Um, but we all sat down and we were eating. And the wife and the husband were like so rude to the like people who were working at the restaurant and everyone else was getting so embarrassed and they were Canadians like us. They actually live like a couple doors down from us and we were just like, wow, like if they knew that we were from Canada because we had like little like flags everywhere, we were like embarrassed for them to, to be with us. And I was just like, you are ruining the experience for everyone. This is crazy. So after we had dinner, we were walking around and in uh, Thailand and in like Vietnam, they have so many like of those like, um, like uh, tuk tuks, uh, which I remembered one of the, the comments that we had on my previous video. Uh, they reminded me of the, the name of it. Yes, the tuk tuk. They have a bunch of tuk tuks everywhere, which is like a vehicle, like a small vehicle. And then there's also a bunch of like scooters that people ride around and motorcycles and all that stuff because it's easier to, I guess, to get, to get around. And so my mom and I, we were like walking on the street with everyone in our group and it was late at night and my mom and I like get to this like um, crosswalk and we're just kind of like waiting for everyone and my mom like is kind of in front and as I see that she's starting to eventually walk out onto the street to cross the road um it wasn't like a main road like it was more of like a, a back road where people were like listening to like music and like watching stuff outside um so it wasn't like a busy main street but it was like a street just like none nonetheless it was just a street and so she like starts to like walk up on the street and um I look over to my left and I see this motorcycle like coming down her way and everyone was just like oh my god you know like she they were like oh my god cherry and my mom was just kind of like what what do you what and the the guy on the motorcycle was going so fast it was so crazy like he just kind of turned the corner and like ripped it down and i swear to god like as soon as he was starting to get close to my mom i grabbed because I, I it was like a split second kind of thing because when they said like sherry like my mom's name um the motorcycle guy was like literally like two feet like I guess behind her kind of and so I grabbed my mom's arm and I like threw her back like towards me like out of the way and so she didn't get hit I think like the side of the motorcycle almost hit her foot like the the wheel but she's okay I think she just had like a bruise there or something like that but like I like grabbed her and if I didn't grab her like my mom would have got hit by a motorcyclist in Thailand like what even so it was so crazy my mom like as soon as everyone was like Sherry just whoosh and then she was like oh my gosh <laughs> like thank god 
thank God you were there because I would have gotten hit. I was like, well, I mean, you know what? This is why you gotta bring me on more trips, mom. That's the thing. Like my mom, she <laughs> she's on a trip even right now. And like she, she travels all the time. And I'm just like, please like, like bring me with you. And I think our next one we wanna do together is go to Japan. Um, so if you guys want to see that i might want to make like a separate channel and do like a vlogging thing um if you guys want to see that i think that would be really really fun i know i'm not that big of a channel quite yet um but i think it would be a lot of fun to do like a live um stream kind of channel i guess or like live vlogs and stuff obviously it probably would just be when I go on trips for now unless I'm doing something um or with my boyfriend who also is doing YouTube so whoever of us gets big then then maybe I don't know let me know what you guys think though if you guys would like to have like a separate channel for vlogs I don't know if I would want to keep it on this channel just because I think it might be a little like weird that it's that it's like that I'm not too sure but I I don't know. Let your girl know though. I hope that you guys like this video. Maybe please consider like, commenting, and subscribing. And please do not forget to check out that shell build that I was talking to you guys about on my Instagram. And uh, go follow me on there because we are almost at 1,000. So yeah, I will see you guys all later. I hope you have a wonderful day slash night wherever you guys are. And I will, I'll catch you all in the next video. Okay, bye everyone.